it's time to get serious about Black Friday. Hey everyone, welcome to my channel, it's Rebecca. And it is that time of year where either you want to crawl in a hole and not come out until January, or you've been playing Christmas music since Halloween. I'm a little bit in between uh, those two people, so I thought what I would do is give you some guidance through the madness. There's a lot of specials out there. Sometimes we go, yeah, okay, cool, I wanna, I, I'll shop that website, and then you're just so overwhelmed. So I hope that I can take away some of that overwhelming, you know, like indecisiveness. Thank you so much for joining this tiny little corner of YouTube. It is, uh, YouTube is kind of weird. I was looking at the trending page and there is not a thing on there that uh, I would watch. I'm not a gamer. I don't need some kind of weird food eating contest vlog. I just I don't know. YouTube's weird. No wonder boomers look at us funny. Am I a boomer? No, I'm a Gen Xer. Here's a little bit of a disclaimer slash small print. Um, if I say a percentage, but I put it across the screen as a correction, definitely follow what's in the description box or across the screen. I think the description box probably trumps screen and screen trumps my mouth. <laughs> If I forgot or I missed a date, then things might have changed because there are websites that have kind of a gradual, so like, you know, they've got, I don't want to call it doorbusters, but you know, when the first day is like the most savings and then things incrementally get a smaller percentage. Okay. But as far as I'm concerned, Pacifica has 30% off their website. If you have decided that some of the things that I've raved about this year from the line you want to give a try or you can't find it in your drug stores or you know kind of target type department stores I love the future youth eye serum as a makeup prep this has peptides and it's got like a strawberry extract and I know that's not exactly what it is but it is kind of this flower uh, science that they've used and I did a video about under eye concealer and how you don't want to use a very heavy eye cream if this is something that you thought yeah I like that I think it feels lovely and it's supposed to of course do great things but it just really does a nice job of setting up uh, the canvas for concealer Speaking of the canvas for concealer, if you're looking at the Nira laser, I did an update on my 90 day results. I am very much enjoying it. It is a slow process. It's kind of like, you know, you want to, you want to be that person that does like planks for a week and then all of a sudden you look like you know, Emily Blunt in an action movie. And it's like, mm, no, uh, it's more of a slow, it's more of a slow of evolution. Uh, the Nira is 25% off site wide. So we've prepped the under eye area. And now I think what I'm gonna do is, you guys, this is way out of left field, but Smashbox sent me their OG primer. This is their, original photo finish primer and what's funny about this it is kind of, it is the original primer like I'm trying to think of other primers out there uh, and probably 10 15 years ago before the days of YouTube or at least the beginning days of YouTube I think it was this primer that I thought oh oh we put that on first um, so it is the Dimethicone it's silky, it's smooth, it has that slip. I think in a clever turn of marketing, they are saying this is your primer for any foundation. It doesn't have to be our 
foundation, it can be somebody else's. I just thought I would mention that because also I've been a fan of Smashbox for a long time and it was very nice of them to reach out to me. So hi Smashbox, that's, I was, I was fangirling. MAC, we talked about MAC foundations recently. This fall, I feel like the two that I tried that I really like are the Studio Fix Everyday Wear and then the Studio uh, Radiance. So this one, they are not cheap. They are in the $30, $40 range. So I find it, it's like, I always thought of MAC as like, okay, it's a mid, mid, price point, you know, it's not cheap, cheap, but it's not like Chanel. And I'm like, how are you doing a $46, $44, whatever foundation? The the MAC website is 30% off. And I figure if this is something that you've been interested in, I also love their velvet lip, uh, lipsticks, (laughs) you know what I'm trying to say. So this one, shade down, it runs very dark, very yellow. And then this one is my like NC20, my usual shade. I'm gonna kind of mix them so you can sort of see what I like about each of them. I'm gonna do a quick, a quick application. Okay, and BK Beauty, site-wide, a variety of different things, 25 to 30% off. The new Nikki LaRose brush set is not included. They did send me that. Thank you, BK Beauty. These are gorgeous. These are phenomenal. This is a pro brush set and it is, dang, it is good. The Angie Hot and Flashy travel brush set that launched this year, that is included in the sale. So, Uh, pretty great. So any of those brushes that I just cannot shut up about, (laughs) it's got, um, they're all on sale. I'm going to take this uh, 109 brush and I'm actually going to prime my brush. Uh, This is a Katie Jane Hughes technique and she's like, you gotta fill in your brush with product. You can't just dabble. You can't just dip it. Speaking of, actually going to put it in the palm of my hand, which I always thought was kind of gross, like a weird thing to do, but I, I'm liking what it's doing. So I'm going to put this in the center and you can see the smash box is just kind of laying a nice little, a little base for, I can't, not pun here. It's like, oh, look at the foundation to my foundation. Look at the base to my base. You get where I'm going with this, right? Right. Okay, cool. This uh, Studio Fix uh, everywhere, this is sort of there all over. They can, you can consider it like, oh, it's a concealer. Oh no, it's a foundation. Um, It, I like it because it has a semi-matte finish and I feel like it has some really good coverage then the Studio Radiance is beautiful and all kinds of things, but just like a little different because of the fact that it is so radiant and the shade is a little bit uh, more, more golden, which I kind of enjoyed because it does cancel my redness, I suppose. All right, let's talk concealer. Uh, House Labs, I haven't seen what House Labs is going to do. Um, so if you haven't tried the concealer yet, but you've been really curious about it, if I would, I mean, I would check, I would check their website because you just, you'll be happy. You'll be, you'll be really happy if they do. I have the shade 12 Rosy is my like pale highlight shade and then I have the shade um what was it called I think it's N13 which is like light neutral and that's like a really good shade as well it's just a little more a little more kind of neutral yellow so I'm just showing you I love this concealer because there is something about when I apply it and then I kind of put it in like I could put it apply it with a brush right now 
but I'm applying it with my fingers. And then what I'm gonna do is I sort of just tap it all over and I really feel like it does this beautiful blur thing. And it could very well be a placebo. It could just be me needing my glasses. I don't know, but I love it. So there, I'm gonna stick with that. Makeup Forever, 30% off their website. If this was something that you saw me use and you thought that is for me, then I suggest you jump on it. They sell out. There is a blush one. I don't have that one. Um, these do sell out. They are really, really lovely palettes. Salt New York is phenomenal. I love that brand. I love that um, Sneaky Balm. That is a little bit more sheer than these. These are kind of an all over everything. A uh, little pricey, uh, but you know, again, it could be something that you just really don't wanna pass up. I did not get my hands on that pencil set that I wanted to buy from the Rouge uh, Sephora sale. Uh, right now what I'm doing is I'm just taking kind of this shade and I'm just kind of going over areas that I have a little bit extra redness and um, that's all I'm doing. Um, and my nose because my nose is always red. So I never got that uh, pencil set. I love the uh, Makeup Forever pencils and now it's sold out on the Makeup Forever website. So I'm a little bummed but you know what? Uh, eventually I'll get it and if I don't I'm okay with that because yeah <laughs> it's okay it's okay I love me my makeup revolution powder you know this I'm gonna use my big BK Beauty powder brush this is the 105 I don't know why I barely use this but it's it's pretty phenomenal <laughs> not gonna lie City Beauty, you guys, I did a video on that. City Beauty has a 40% uh, off their website through Cyber Monday. You guys know my favorites there. If you don't, I'll link the video. Wander Beauty, also 30% off. Love, I love everything Wander Beauty does. Um, this palette right here is so lovely. They have two shades. This is sort of their light and then they have a darker version. This is such a beautiful, just, it's, it's for the face and eyes and you can use everything everywhere. The Makeup Revolution, if Revolution is doing a web uh, a, a sale or if the um, Ulta is giving uh, special savings on them. I would definitely, this is the cream bronzer that won the Allure Award and it is so good. It, I love this cream bronzer. I have shade light and you guys, I had, this is kind of my summer of cream bronzers. Hard Candy, their liquid bronzer in Sweet Tea, loved Pacifica bronzer in since no sandy kiss love and then ColourPop rincon beach bronzer stick love it so rincon point rincon point um yeah just um take your pick and then this one <laughs> they're so good i might even be missing one ah you know i just i love these i really really love them and uh, put a little right there, yeah. Speaking of ColourPop, I love their light sticks and I actually have shade Ignite. This is a highlighter, but this one is kind of gold and it can almost be a bronzer and a highlighter together. And I think it's just beautiful. And I will show you when I put it on my lips because I think that's when the magic really happens. ColourPop has all kinds of sales. They have 50% off specific items throughout the week. They have 30% uh, off the website, um, but I think then you have to kind of pick and choose in terms of, I don't think you can get 30% off the website and then 50% off like a lippy stick on that day. I don't know. 
maybe, maybe. Um, they also have specials on like certain palettes. Their nine pan palettes are like $9 and they have different flash specials going on. I love this little bubbly, feeling bubbly palette. You guys, you guys, you guys, Jouer has 30% off their website. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Let me show you the things I love from Jouer. Jouer Shadow Crayons. By the way, these are my progressive readers. Love them, they're from Peepers. So this is the part that doesn't have any strength or correction. And then this is the part that's the readers and then I can see what I'm doing. <laughs> All right, we have shade Modern and shade, oh, this is surreal. If you are looking for a one and done shadow crayon, this Modern is gorgeous. It is gorgeous. Jouer Shadow Crayons I like better than some of the high-end like Laura Mercier, Bobbi Brown. Um, Surreal is a beautiful kind of taupe and it's more matte. This one has um, a shimmer to it and um, you can just, there's so much you can do with these. I'm going to take the modern and I'm going to put it all over my lid and you can see I think that they just go on beautifully and I've been such a fan of Jouer for so long and I um yeah and I just I like I like the way the brand has just beautiful products it is not too expensive it's um it's not cheap but it's not like crazy if that makes sense It's kind of like Wander Beauty. It's like, love, love the brand, love how just everything about kind of, you know, like, I feel like, oh, I could work there. Yeah, you know, like, oh, that's not just a company I want to, I want to wear their stuff. But it's like, I think if I lived <laughs> near their headquarters and they offered me a job, I would like really enjoy myself. This is their Soft Focus Hydrate and Set Powder. So I shared how Nikki LaRose talks about you should use loose powder to set your makeup. And I feel like a powder like this is kind of the exception because it's so fine and so soft that if you wanted to use it to set your makeup, it absolutely would work. But then it's also a beautiful finishing powder and a touch up powder. And Jouer powders are talc free. And I feel like, you know, um, if you're looking for something that you want to treat yourself, but you don't want to go like, you don't want to go $80. <laughs> you want to stick with 30 or under. <laughs> this is such a lovely, lovely choice because you'll just, ah, you'll just feel so happy to like, yeah, so I'm going to take, I'm gonna do it two ways for you. I'm gonna take a puff and just show you how you can um, just gently do it that way and it's not cakey, it's not chalky and you will look lovely and flawless or you can take a very soft brush. Am I going to hit pan on this one? That's kind of exciting. And you can just, and I've already powdered, you know, with the Makeup Revolution powder. So this is actually more of a finish than a set. Um, but it's, it's just lovely. I'm going to actually go over my forehead. Look at that. I just kind of erased, <laughs> I just erased the lines in my forehead. That was, that was significant right there. That was beautiful. This is gold here, this zesty. Let's see what happens. Oops. Oh. Mm. Magic happened, that's what. <sighs> you guys, if I sing Celine Dion, my cat Phoebe climbs on my chest and checks and gets in my face like, are you okay? <laughs> the other cats run and then my cat is like, 
do I need to call someone? <laughs> I just think that's really funny. Sorry, I almost started, I almost broke out in song when I saw this, this eyeshadow. <laughs> Drugstore and high-end-ish for my brows because I love the Lift and Snatch from NYX and I love Benefit. This brow um, wax styler is so good, but so is Maybelline, you know? So let's get, do a little bit of both. And then let's do the, okay, so we've got that on there. I'm gonna do my, where are you? My Milk Kush Brow, Milk Kush Brow. That sounds like a new beverage. <laughs> Maybelline Brow Styler. I actually have this in like light brown. People ask me what shade. So if I haven't, I typically don't use the shade Blonde in brands of, in any of the brow products for a variety of brands. Um, it just usually pulls a little too red for me. So I usually go with some kind of taupe or like a light brunette. Mascara, Rumi Cosmetics, What's Up Beauty, City Beauty. Those three mascaras that are independent brands have really good ingredients to help I don't know if hair growth is a promise uh, that, you know, I can like fully say yes, but the idea is that they nurture and do and, and create a way of giving you lovely lashes, but also taking care of your lashes. This is the What's Up Beauty, and we, I recently just shared the Dragon palette that they launched. So this is the mascara that introduced me to their brand, and it's beautiful. It really, really is beautiful. Okay, Jones Road has some specials for the holidays. They have sets and minis. Oh, it is so much fun. Okay, so they sent me my own little <laughs> JRB. Jones Road Beauty. Um, mini Miracle Balm, you guys. Can we talk about Miracle Balm for a second? It is probably the bane. <laughs> it's the thing I love that I, it's, it's, <sighs> ginger oil, there are so many oils in there that should react with my skin and give me a rosacea flare. And I really, I haven't had it happen but I am so cautious. So I just wanna let you know that the Miracle Balms do have essential oils in them. They can have the kinds that are very triggering if you have sensitivities that are triggered by volatile components, which those are anything from like an orange oil, um, a ginger root oil. So ginger root extract is less triggering than ginger root oil, but the oils in the balm, you know, on paper say that they trigger my rosacea, but I haven't had a problem with them and I really apply them sparingly. I don't apply them directly to my skin. So I think there's ways of making everything, everything work. Golden Hour is one of their most popular Miracle Balms, they came out with Happy Hour a month ago, and now they have that in a full size, and I think Golden, I think they had it in a mini over the holidays. So I decided with you, I am going to show you the mini Golden Hour Miracle Balm first, first hand. We can experience the, this together. Because when you break the seal of a Miracle Balm, a literal angel sing. I'm just kidding. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you can smell it. You can smell it. Some people love that. Some people rave about their essential oils. Good for you. I'm happy for you. I'm jealous. Um, so just letting you know. Okay. Here it is. I want to make sure I'm in focus because there's only one. This is this is like blowing up the tanker in Tenet, you guys. This is or the the plane 
This is Christopher Nolan blowing up a plane in Tenet, the movie. Uh, it's only going to happen once. Ready? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Do you see that? So there's a little bit of micro glitter in some of these formulas, but it is really just meant to enhance. It is not dramatic. However, the golden hour I think is the most subtle in terms of has a glisten, has a sheen, has Martin sheen, but not, not glittery. Happy hour has a bit of glitter. Tiny. And Bobby loves it. Bobby's like, you know, Bobby, you think of this minimalist, like, I'm just going to wear black and, you know, kind of not give any cares. And then she's like, no, I love glitter. <laughs> I'm just going, okay. That really surprised me. And the idea is you can use it up here. You can use it anywhere you want. Oh, I told you guys I was going to use um, the ColourPop on my lips. Let me show you. Okay, so what this is doing, if you live in a very cold, very dry climate, um, and you kind of need extra when it comes to your makeup and you want to wear something or you're going on a ski holiday, the Miracle Balm will just give you that barrier without it looking like it'll be like, this is fun. This is special. I look polished and youthful and, you know, I look like really alive and healthy, but, um, you're actually making a barrier for your, <laughs> for your dry skin. So one of my favorite makeup forever pencils is wherever Walnut. And this is just such a wonderful neutral pencil. This is what I was talking about with the whole, Oh gosh, I really want that set because um, the Makeup Forever pencils that you sharpen, you can use them on your brows, your eyes, your lips. They're so, so good. And yeah, <laughs> so that's another one of my picks for the Makeup Forever website. Now, if you want to use a ColourPop, um, so this is shade Brink. It's a matte lippy stick. And it's kind of a, just a lovely, not too dark. The Ignite light stick. I like to just do that. It's kind of funny. I called it the Ignite Light Stick, but it's their light, <clears throat> it's their highlighter stick and it's the shade Ignite. I, I want to make a video fun for you that doesn't make you feel like I'm telling you to buy something but I wanna help you in the decision-making process. So if anything I'm showing you or any of the brands I'm showing you, you don't care for, that's okay. I mean, if you wanna tell me in the comments, that's fine, that's your, that's your decision, but it doesn't really change. Like, I still like them, you know? If you don't like them, that's fine. It doesn't, we don't have to like all the same things. Um, we're not dating, <laughs> uh, but I just wanted to point those out and I thought instead of just sharing what's on sale, sharing with you what I love on those websites and some of these products I have used for years. Um, maybe I don't use them on camera as much, but they've been in my <laughs> on my makeup table for some time. Some were sent to me in PR and so that gave me the opportunity to get introduced to it because maybe I wouldn't have bought it. Um, either I didn't know about it or I just wouldn't have thought of it. So there's a number of reasons. It's not like, oh, she's just loyal to this or she's just loyal to that. And you know, this video is not sponsored. However, I do get commission on some of the links in the description box. And I really, really appreciate you shopping through my links. 
Some of these affiliate links, because they are site-wide sales, there's not a special code. It's not like Frugalista or anything like that. So you shopping through my link is what gives me the commission. Thank you so much. Again, um, I will sign off now because that's enough, Rebecca, okay? I really hope you are enjoying this time. Hang in there. Don't forget to sleep. Don't forget to hydrate. As much as you want to take, have a cocktail, maybe take some chamomile tea, you will sleep better at night. I mean, drink, but you know, remember that alcohol is not the answer, chocolate is. I'm kidding. I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, thank you so much. I'll see you next time, bye.